in previous class i teach you star topology now i am going to teach you tree topology okay see tree topology so in tree topology <coughs> computers are connected with a hub like a star topology but in tree topology there there in hub there has two hub one is one is central hub and which is also called as active hub or second one is passive hub or secondary hub okay so computers are connected with through the hub as i am drawing a picture okay so stumps are connected with the second hub okay in this way so what is tree topology tree topology is a variation of tree topology is a variation of tree topology is a variation of is a variation of <coughs> star star as in a as in a <coughs> as in a star node or star topology in a tree in a tree linked to a central hub linked to a central hub okay as i told you ki that there is a central hub and central hub through central hub or the primary hub Uh, the secondary hub is also connected and uh, data transfer through the hubs okay so linked to a central hub okay so however not every device plug directly to the directly into the central hub that means so not every device every not every device plug or connect directly into the directly into the central hub see as i told you uh, not every device directly plug into the central hub that means these devices are not directly connected with the central hub they are connected with the secondary hub or passive hub which which hub is connected with the central hub okay now the majority of devices are connected to a secondary hub that in turn it is connected to the central hub okay so uh, the central hub in the tree the central hub in the tree is an active hub is an active hub and an active hub contains 
एक्टिव हब कंटेन एक्टिव हब कंटेन्स अ रिपीटर विच इन विच इज अ हार्डवेयर डिवाइस विच इज अ हार्डवेयर डिवाइस दैट रीजेनरेट दैट रीजेनरेट दैट रीजेनरेट विच दैट रीजेनरेट दैट रिसिव्ड बिट पैटर्न रीजेनरेट द रिसिव्ड बिट पैटर्न pattern that means through this hub how through this hub they uh, send uh, the sent uh, the bits which is regenerated by the central hub bit patterns before sending them out before sending them out to the another systems okay and the secondary hub secondary hub hub or you can say that the passive hub passive hub provides a simple physical connections simple physical connections between the attached devices between the attached devices okay so uh, one is central hub and, and and these are secondary hub or passive hub secondary hub or passive hub you can say that passive hub okay so what are the disadvantages of this three disadvantage so first is it is because uh, is a large number of cables required see how many cables are required so large number of large number of cables required for conf configurations or configuration or installations okay second is if more nodes are added <coughs> if more nodes are added then its maintenance is difficult maintenance is difficult obviously if you make more complex then it is difficult to manage maintenance because large number of nodes or uh, if if any if any node fail or any hub fail it is difficult to maintain and third one is if the hub fail if the hub fail it is difficult
it is difficult to pass out data and all the systems may crash. And systems crash. Okay. And what are the advantages of advantages of <clears throat> what are the advantages advantages of a tree topology advantages of the tree topologies are if if uh, because see the addition of secondary hub however bring uh, to further advantages if first it allow more ad devices to be attached to a central hub can be uh, there increase the distance signal can travel between the devices okay it allow the network increase so through the central hub through sorry through the passive hub we can increase increase the number of hubs uh, sorry we can increase the number of nodes the number of nodes so that we can uh, we can uh, increase of data transfer number of so the through the passive hub we can increase the number of nodes through the passive hub we can increase we can add more uh, passive hub through the central hub and we can increase the number of nodes also and second one is <coughs> second advantage is it is easy to it is through the uh, we can uh, we can uh, increase the distance signal can travel between the devices okay we can we can increase <coughs> increase the distance signal distance signal can travel so can travel to isolate and prioritize and prioritize prioritize communication form communication from different computers different computers so these are all about tree topology advantages and disadvantages okay thank you